on them to get out. Remember, Marlon made a game out of it. So Dory wouldn't get stung. Okay, and then Marlon told Dory that he wanted her to leave, and this made her really sad. So what is the what happened as an effect of this? Dino, can you tell us? Um, the moon face here sorry up by doing their impression of sailing a sailing ship and even naming it. Yep. The moonfish cheered Dory up because Marlin made her sad. Okay, Dory got stung by the jellyfish. What happened as a result of this, Jon Snow? Marlon came back to save her. Yep, Marlon came back to save her. Okay, so Jon Snow said Dory got stung by the jellyfish, and Marlon came back to save her. All right, and our last one. Marlon and Dory both got stung and fainted. The what happened as a result of this? Marlon and Dory got stung and fainted. Okay, and what's the matching effect? Um, crush who saw the uh, whole thing saved them and took them along. All right, good job. So crush saved them and took them along because they got stung by the jellyfish and fainted. Okay. Does anyone have any questions about this homework? Easy, right? Okay. So next, let's talk about, actually, we're going to do this. We're going to do a little bit of a quiz first. So if you have your booklet, open it, please, to page 47. And you're going to do this on your own. I want to see how much everyone knows about the movie so far. So if you have your book, open it to page 47. If not, get a piece of paper and a pencil out and I will display the questions on the screen. And I want everyone to answer the questions on their own. We'll take five minutes for you to write down the answers by yourselves, and then we will check them together. Okay, so it's a quick quiz. And when you're finished, give me a thumbs up or raise your hand if you're finished so I know who's done and who's still working. Do you have a question? I am finished. Let's start with number one. Where was Dr. Sherman, or where does P. Sherman, I guess he doesn't really live there, but his dentist's office. Uh, James, where is P. Sherman? Mr. Sherman is live in dentist's office. Do you remember the, the address of his office? Australia. Okay, so we know that's the country. What about the street name? Um, Does it on the, think. okay. Wallaby Way. Yes. What number on Wallaby Way? 42. Yep, 42. Wallaby Way. And do you remember the city in Australia? What's up? Let's see. What's our city? It's Sydney. Yes, very good. Sydney is in Australia. Good job. Okay. What was Dr. Sherman going to do with Nemo? Why does he have Nemo? Sierra, can you tell us? I think that he is catching him to give it to her niece. Okay. And what's the niece's name? Darla. Okay. He caught Nemo to give him to her. His niece, Darla. Yeah, Darla is a little girl with the, who looks crazy. All right. Yeah. What is Nemo's nickname in the tank bang? Ling Ji, do you remember his nickname? Shark Bait. Yep, they called him Shark Bait. Good job. Okay. Um, and what is Gil's plan to escape? 
how did he want to escape? Everyone, all the other fish were too big to do it. So what did they need Nemo to do? Mm. Do you remember what Nemo was small and where he was small enough to fit into? Um, yes. Tell me. Gil's plan is wanted to mean Nemo to go into the tube, into the machine, and throw a rock into the motor to get it malfunction. Okay, so Gil wanted Nemo to throw a rock in the we'll call motor. That a water filter motor to break it. Okay, and what would happen once it's broken? Um, the tank can't be clean. Okay, once it broke. Once it broke, the tank would become very dirty. Is that not clean? Okay. And what would uh, P. Sherman have to do? P. Um, he uh, would have to uh, put the fish out of the tank and. Uh, when um, the fish is out of the tank, they can roll to the ocean. Once the fish got out of the tank, they would be able to roll out the window to the ocean. Okay. Did this plan work all the way, Mid A? Did this plan work? Uh, this plan didn't work. Can you tell me why? Uh, because uh, at the first time uh, the uh, the motor was too strong that it uh, the the motor was too strong that uh, it uh, destroyed the rock. The okay, second time, to... the second time, uh, uh, P. Sherman put a machine to uh, make it cleaner. All right, so we'll say the plan didn't work because Philip Sherman. Um, replace the motor with an automatic scanner. Remember the thing that scanned the whole fish tank? That kept the tank clean. An automatic means it does it by itself. So Philip Sherman does not need to do, does not need to clean the tank. Okay, so. Okay. Does anyone have any questions about our quiz here? Or do you think who got all of the questions correct? Give me a thumbs up or raise your hand if you got them all correct. On. So I'll send all of this home with you if you need to, if you haven't had time to write all of it. Okay, so let's look at, we're gonna watch a three minute clip of this video, okay? And while we're watching it, I want everyone to think about the mood of the scene, okay? Mood means like the feeling. Okay, what feelings can we get from watching the scene? So the things to think about are, what does the, what time are we? What time does the scene take place? Um, what colors do you see? Do you see dark colors or do you see bright colors? What sounds do you hear? What do the characters, what do they look like and how do they act? Okay. So think of all those things and that's going to give us clues as to the mood of this scene. Are we ready? Okay, can everyone hear the sound? Give me a thumbs up if you can hear. Swim through the ring of fire. 
From this moment on, you will now be known as Okay, so let's look at some different parts of this scene. Okay, let's talk about the setting. What time of day is it, first of all? Let's see. James, what time of day is it during this scene? James, are you there? It's is when it's night. Yes. Time. It is nine. Very good. Okay. And let's look at the colors here. Are we the colors in the fish tank and in the, the dentist's office? Are we looking at very like bright colors or are we looking more like darker colors? Who is TMB07? Nike. Maggie? Okay, Maggie, what kind of colors are we seeing here? Um, dark colors. Yep. We're seeing dark colors. Okay. Um, the Feng Tao, when Nemo starts swimming towards the rest of the fish, what kind of sounds are they making? <laughs> So, what kind of sounds do you hear? Where did Feng Tao just go? Um, I think uh, the uh, the sound uh, like um is uh, serious or yep. so we'll say serious music right and what about the chanting when they're the other fish what they're saying is it getting louder or is it getting softer as the as Nemo goes towards them um, it is louder so the chanting gets louder okay and how do we think Nemo feels at the beginning of this as he's moving towards the other fish Scared a bit, a bit. He's feeling scared a bit. Yep. So I'll say Nemo is scared at first. Okay. Then let's look at how the, our characters are dressed and what our other characters look like. Our let's say bloat and the other fish. What are they wearing, Dino? No. What well, can you say? Are they wearing like, what is it that they've put on themselves? Leaves. Leaves, right? Do they do, use it as sort of like a costume, right? Yeah. Okay. So they're, say, other fish are wearing costumes. And how do they look? Do they look happy? No, they look serious. Mm -hmm. So we'll say they're wearing costumes and look serious okay good job and then what is it that they ask nemo to do also what do they ask nemo to do we just watched it elsa what do they want nemo to do the ring of fire so, elsa what is it that they want nemo to do they want they want Nemo to go through the ring of fire. They want Nemo to go through the ring of fire. Okay. And, you know, Nemo's a bit scared at first. And how does he find the courage to get through the ring of fire? Who helps him get through the ring of fire? Lily? Uh, Gil. He looked at Gil's eyes and... Gil said, uh, Gil, I want to say, 
Uh, you can do it. So it's like Gil gives him a reassuring nod to give him confidence. Okay. And what happens at the end here? Does Nemo make it through the Ring of Fire, Jon Snow? What? Does, does Nemo make it through the Ring of Fire to the other side? Yes. All right, so we know Nemo is able to make it through the Ring of Fire with help. And what does he realize at the end? Let's see. He thinks it's very scary at first. And then... So what does he realize at the end of this? Um, Mitzi, what does he realize? Is it as scary as he thought at first? That's scary. He realizes that it wasn't so scary after all. Okay, so he just needed some bit of help from his friends to realize that doing something that can seem scary might not be so scary after all, right? So if you just are brave and try things, you know, it might not be as hard as you think. Okay, so that's that scene. This moment on, you will now be known as... Okay, so let's move on. All right, and then do you remember what happens here? So we only have about not eight minutes left, so I'm just going to tell you. So this is the part where Nemo goes to put the first pebble into the, the motor of the water filter. And he gets it in there, but then the motor's too strong, like we've said earlier, and Nemo gets sucked back up into the tube. So Kent, what do you think would happen if Nemo got sucked all the way back into the tube and went through the motor? Feng Tao. Okay, B. Yeah. So, if Nemo got sucked back into the motor, what might have happened to him? To him? Mm, he will. So our motor's spinning really, really, really fast, like a helicopter. Like a helicopter. Um, and what might happen if he gets sucked back through the help the motor? Uh, he cannot get out. Okay. And even worse, what could happen? The motor is like a fan. He, he will die. He might die. So is this safe or dangerous? It's dangerous. Right? And then after, he, he ends up getting out, and then he's very afraid. So let's talk about some more events here. So how does, what happens here? Why does Nigel come up to the fish tank? On your thumbnail. Dino, why does Nigel come to the fish tank? Uh, I, uh, I don't remember. It, it to tell Nemo that uh, his dad is fighting him or not. I don't remember. Yep, that's exactly right. Nigel comes to the tank to tell Nemo that his dad has traveled far to find him. Okay. And then, how does Nemo feel about this? Also, how does Nemo feel now that he knows his dad's traveled through the whole ocean to find him? What do you think, Elsa? Mm. How might you feel if you found out that your father has traveled the entire world to come rescue you? Mm. Are you going to feel sad about it? I have a word to describe it. Okay, well, tell me some other words that you might think of. Um, Any word, Elsa? Chimai, how might you feel? Chimai, are you there? Lily, how would you feel? 
I will feel surprised and happy. Surprised and happy. Okay, so then what does he do? Ling Chi, what does he do after this? He he tried again to stop to stop the the um the the, the, the motor chamber. Mm -hmm. So he goes back into the motor chamber. Chamber is like a room to stop the motor again. Okay, and does he succeed this time? Yes. Okay. Yes, he does. He did. He really did. Why is it black? Oh, yeah. So say Nemo is able to stop the motor this time. Okay. All right, let's move on to our next page. So we're going to have to finish this tomorrow, our relationship between Dory and Marlin. We have our live quizzes now. Um, for homework today, you're going to do a cause and effect chart, similar to what we did yesterday, except for instead of matching, you are, I've given, I filled out half of the chart for you, and you need to fill out the rest of the chart. Okay, so for number one, Nemo tries to block the tank filter again. Okay, and then what is the cause of this? Why does he try to block the filter again? Okay, the next we have our causes filled out. The whale releases the water from its blowhole, and what is the effect of this? Okay, Darla shakes the bag to wake him up, and why does she do this? Okay, so fill out the cause and effect chart, and we will check it tomorrow. Okay, does anyone have any questions? about what we've talked about today. No. 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 Okay. No. no. No, never. So let's do our live quizzes. What did we do? So if we get kicked off, come back on and we'll do the live quizzes together. Um, did we do uh, classic or team? Yes, on Friday.